Hey guys, today I want to show you Ghost Hood. What is Ghost Hood? Ghost Hood is a company from Germany. They make lightweight camouflage material, so you can camouflage your body, your equipment and almost everything. It's made for hunters, for photographers and also for military and police. So almost everyone who needs camouflage can use it. The coolest thing about it is it's really compact. So inside this small bag, it's a three liter watertight bag by Ottlieb. There is the ghost legs, the ghost hoodie, the tripod camo and the optic camo inside. So I can cover my complete body and my camera with bipod, bipod, tripod, sorry. So this is really cool. When it's so compact and light, it's easier to bring it. When I remember my ghillie suits, they were all heavier than this and they will get wetter than this. Now to the products. At first I have the hoodie. So it's a ghost hoodie. It's like a poncho. I can wear it over my insulation jacket and also over tactical gear. Now for demonstration I wear this black hat and this black shirt and can be covered up with the ghost hoodie. So this is the ghost hoodie. I don't have the weight of all products in mind, so I will write it somewhere in the picture. The ghost hoodie should be something around 320 gram. So this is really compact and lightweight. So to use it, you just can throw it over your head like a poncho. And when I hold it like this, you can already see how good it camouflages, even in this rocky environment. Later in this video, I will show you how it works. Well, that it works. So now I can use it like a poncho with my hat sticking out. There are also gloves attached to it, but they are like mittens. So you have the thumb and four fingers. So when you're a photographer or you're outside, you don't really need gloves to camouflage your hands because this already works. Then for the head, there is this hood. There is some bug mesh in front of your eyes so you can look through. If you don't like it, just remove it with scissors, cut a hole inside. Yeah, and that's the hoodie. Covers up a lot and it even fits a small backpack underneath. Now, there's also this opening in front. This is not for peeing, this is an optic opening. So when you use it with a rifle, when you're a hunter or a sniper, you can place your rifle inside and then the optic, so the scope, can look through. So here will be the scope and here will be the barrel. Right now, when I'm a photographer, I can also use this to cover up the camera like this. And now with the hoodie alone, I have relatively good camouflage and photograph like this. And I can even observe through here if I want to. So this is what this opening in front is made for. And you can see it's really easy to handle. It fits all sizes and this is really cool. Especially if you are a unit, you order 10 pieces and it fits everyone in the unit. Now, now here are the ghost legs. Yeah, two of them. So it's not a pants, it's also uni-size, so one size fits all. When you don't have it on your feet, you can use it to camouflage equipment. So for example, it's really easy to camouflage the camera and slide it over everything. But it's made for the legs, so you can just put your leg with the boot inside. And then you can secure it up here. There's elastic with a cord locker. This already is holding quite good, but there's also a slotted button up here. This is made to attach it to one of your belt loops. So you can wrap it around and stick it through or just make a knot, however you want to. And then it's really safe.
It's big enough so it even fits over tactical gear with bigger pockets. Or also over warm insulation clothing. Okay, now this is how it looks. The size alone already works as some kind of camouflage. And there are also covers for the shoes or for the boots. Right now I'm wearing black boots, so not perfect for camouflage. And you have covers on the ghost legs to cover up your boots and even the soles of the boots. They are made from a thin material. This is not made for walking long ways, but this is for when you are in the position and you want to camouflage your boots and also will take some time to damage it. If you don't need it, you can just roll it up and then you don't have to use the shoe covers. Now to the tripod and the optic camo. This is also inside the small bag. So here's the optic camo. This is made for spotting scopes and for big lenses. Even the Nikon 800 lens will fit inside since this is the opening. I'm not sure if you can see it in the camera, but it's really big. Right now I don't have a tailor lens with me. I'm not here doing uh, wildlife photography. I'm here to photograph equipment and gear. And for this, this 85 millimeter lens is just perfect. But it will even fit bigger lenses. I have one stopper in front, one here, and then you now you can see how long it is. And now on the screen of the camera I can't even see this. <laughs> yeah, so I can even place my head underneath and you, you have covered up all this shadow. And this material is so thin, you can look through when you're close enough and you can get an idea of the surrounding. There's also a button here if you want to close it, if you use a bigger lens, then this will hold it together. Now if I don't need it, I can just roll it up, stick it underneath or just let it hang like this. This is not waterproof, this is only camouflage. So it's highly breathable, it's lightweight and moisture can get away from the camera and from the lens. This can also be nice, but when it's raining heavy, just use a normal rain cover for your camera and then use the optic camo on top of it. Okay, now to the tripod. The tripod comes in this bag and is also packed in itself. So this is the tripod. It's all made from the same material, so really lightweight and thin, but I personally trust it. So, the tripod is five parts. The one, which is the back, is used for the middle section of the tripod. Just slide it over and then you have a stopper and a loop. Pull this through and then you can tighten it and the middle section of the tripod is camouflaged. Then you have the upper part, which is with two buttons, two loops, and up here one more loop, and again elastic with a stopper. You can just wrap this around, you can go up high when you want to, put this stopper to the first loop, tighten it, and then you have these buttons and the loops to close it. It's made that way, so you can still use everything from the bipod. If you want to cover it up even more, you can improvise with it. Okay, and the legs, really simple. They are tubes, which you just slide over the legs of the tripod, and then you tighten two elastics, and then it's camouflaged. So, really easy.
You can see it's relatively long. I'm not sure about the length, but I will write it somewhere in the picture. You can use it for shorter bipods by just putting this together and then you have this elastic with the stopper, you tighten it and then you can even use it on small bipods or tripods. And on the tripod camo, it's also nice that you can still adjust the tripod through the material. So you can change the length of it through the material. So you can see this is really nice. So even when you are in the position, you can rotate the rings like you need it. And then you can set it up really easy. On all of the products you have C-fixes. In the case of the Ghost Legs and Ghost Hoodie, these are those small laser cut leaves from Kodura. They are made to attach vegetation or adaptive camouflage material like raffia or burlap or even from Ghost Hood. There will be some additional camouflage you can buy like the oak green and brown is already available and there will be other things you can attach to these C-fixes. Now, time for some demonstration of the effectiveness of this camouflage pattern. I have to tell you, I have not tested it in an area like this before, but we will see, I will just throw this over. And then we will see how it works. Have fun. Time for the conclusion. I really like that the material and all the equipment is really lightweight. Especially when you are in the mountains and also when you are in a tactical environment, often you have to carry a lot of weight and then when you bring, have to bring a 2 kilogram ghillie suit, you have to think twice. With this lightweight material, you have got a lot of new options. So that's for me personally the best point. And it's also infrared safe. So it's not only visible protection, it's also infrared safe. So this is really important for your tactical guys and also for some hunters out there. Yeah, so thank you for watching. That's it. Hope you liked it. Feel free to subscribe and give me a thumbs up if you want. And see you next time. Bye.